Evaluate logarithms. Question 4. Evaluate the following. A is log to the base 1 of 2, log to the base of minus 2 of 2, log 1 to the power of minus 2, and minus log 4 of 1. So you try to do them and here is my solution. The first one is log 1 basis 1 for this to the power of 2. Well, if you remember, we cannot have base of 1 for log. And here is the reason. Let us say that log to the base 1 of 2 is equal to x, correct? In that case, if I write it in exponential form, what do I get? So this implies that 2 is equal to 1 to the power of x. Now 1 to the power of anything is only 1, right? Therefore, it is not possible. This is a very important question also to understand why base of 1 is not possible. Because 1 to the power of anything will only be 1, right? It is never an exponential function. It is a constant function, correct? So therefore, log to the base 1 doesn't work. So log of the base where base should be. So if I have log base of x, then b has to be greater than 0 and b is not equal to 1. So that is the restriction on the base of the log, correct? Now, the next one, log to the base of minus 2 equals to 2. Now, this again is not possible since base should be greater than 0 and not equal to 1, correct? Now, at times, Mathematically, it may make sense, right? So we'll take up later those things. But since exponential functions are not defined for negative base and log is reciprocal, inverse, and log is inverse of exponential function, this is not possible, right? So this is not in the domain, right? Not possible. Or we should have no solution for this, right? Now this is log to the base 10. If nothing is mentioned, the base is 10. Log to the base 10 of 1 to the power of minus 2. Now, what is this equal to? So let's try it out. You know log of 1 is always 0. Why is it so? Let's try to figure it out. Let's say that log to the base 10 of this is x. It means what? It means 1 to the power of minus 2 is equal to 10 to the power of x. Now 1 to the power of anything will only be 1, right? So it is 1 equals to 10 to the power of x. Now if I want 10 to the power of x to be 1, then x has to be 0, right? So this implies x equals to 0. Do you understand? And therefore x equals to 0 is the only x 0 is the intercept. That is the sorry. Log of 1 is always 0. Do you understand? That is the x-intercept for a log function. Okay. Next one. So we have minus log to the base 4 of 1. Correct? So it is minus. But log to any base of 1, we learned just now, is 0. Right? So we get this as 0. And minus 0 or 0 is the same thing. Correct? So the answer is 0. So base could be anything of 1 is always 0 as we saw here. Do you see that? So these are very special questions on logarithms and I hope you understand all the concepts here. Things to remember. 1 and that is that is that the base B should be greater than 0 and B is not equal to 1. Second thing which we learned here was that log of any base for 1 is equal to 0. Correct? So these are two important things to learn and that is how we can also show. Correct? Thank you.